ready to go. And they're away racing. Marginally slow out the gate there was Maru Bial, also gone back there is Round Hitman and uh, Sangim Daypio. Solchin Chon, however, on the far side, not too quick out either at the right end of the field. Cupid rise away nicely, as was Cloud Harden to the inside, Kangshol Bidet. Wider on the track is Magic Impact. Widest of all is the favourite, Young One Fantastic, so he's going to have to be caught wide here. Just sitting behind this leading group is uh, PNS Ni, one ahead of Sangim Daypio, up on the inside of Malu Bio, followed by X Factor, Sungshin Chanha. The back marker by some margin is round Hitman. So four left to travel with Cloud Hard in front, half a length over Cupid Rise in second, three wide, Magic Impact third. A length and a half more then to Kangshol Bude, who's just up on the inside of Yong One Fantastic, who's finally found it in. It's then three to four lengths further back to uh, Sungshin Chanha, Maru Bial, and then it is uh, PNSB up on the inside. But coming into the straight, the leaders now, and it is Cupid Rise who's taken over as Cloud Heart gives way. In second is Magic Impact, a couple of lengths further back then to Kangshol Bude. Uh, now it will be Sungshin Chanha and Yong One Fantastic down the outside, 300 to travel. Cupid Rise still has the lead. Momentum, though, is with Sungshin Chonha, who now goes past Magic Impact up into second place. It is Cupid Rise. Sungshin Chonha is drifting all over the track here, but is out in front, drifts back again. If he can step in a straight line, he's going to win this. Sungshin Chonha, a double for Furkan. His second was Cupid Rise, flashing home late. Sangim Daipio, I think, might just have pinched third. Sungshin Chonha, Furkan Yuxel for Tony Castaniera and owner Kim J. Young. It wasn't pretty, but it got the job done. This three-year-old gelding, he's by Girolamo. It's a maiden win at start eight. Sungshin Chanha now second was Cupid Rise. Third was Sangim Daypio, then came Maru Bio. Magic Impact up.